Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be talking about a very interesting project I've found um, in regards to the Raspberry Pi. Uh, first of all, I'd like to thank you for coming onto my channel, having a look at my video. This is the first video uh, I've done, so I'm not sure how it will go. Um, so anyway, this is raspberrycolocation.com and this is really really interesting concept that I've never really seen before um, there's a company uh, called PC Extreme um, and they're a German company or Dutch company and they are web hosts virtual private servers hosting dedicated servers domain names you know the usual business and what they do is they're offering free Raspberry Pi hosting with the only cost of you sending the Pi in. Um, so as we can see here they've got 570 Pi's currently online and here's what we get. So you get a 100 meg uplink connection, you get 500 gigabytes of IP ver version 6 and IP version uh, 4 sorry, um, <coughs> monthly traffic, you get a free power supply and free space in the data center and you know, I don't know about you, but 500 gig, that is a lot. You know, I don't think anyone would really, really use that up. So, <coughs> okay. So what you can do, there's two options. Um, you can buy a pre-purchased, pre-installed uh, Raspberry Pi. Um, <coughs> starts at 52 euros, VAT included, or then you can send your own one in, um, which is for free. question and answers you know there's lots of really really inf interesting information applications so here are a couple of things that they are suggesting um, so <coughs> mail server could be used for a mail server uh, monitoring XMPP chat server VPN tunnel web server DNS server so you know some really interesting uh, ideas there um, and you've got to remember, you know, you're saving the power. And and really, if you don't want to do something <coughs> with uh, the GPIO pins or anything hardware related to the Raspberry Pi, then I really think this is a good way to go. And here we go. Look, too long, didn't read. We're doing this because we have fun doing it to educate ourselves and to spare the environment ag alongside your wallet. So, so the terms and conditions, obviously, phase bandwidth. Uh, abuse. I don't know. I haven't looked at the terms and conditions, but you know, it's obviously something you need to look at it in depth if you want to do it. But they will send it back uh, here. So returns. So after the termination of service uh, initiated by the customer or PC Extreme, you will have the opportunity to pick up your Raspberry Pi at our data center or to have it sent back to you by mail. So shipping fees depend on your location, ranging from seven euros to thirty euros. So you know you can get it back if you want whenever you want <coughs> best efforts so reboots and reinstalls are performed on a best effort basis within an eight to five time window apart from that we're forced to charge 20 euros for a reinstall of the Pi to cover the time such an operation costs so <coughs> what you've got to remember here then is you know obviously if something goes wrong you know you install something you break the Pi it gets hacked you know whatever happens they're going to charge you um, to fix it out but you know something really interesting something to look at I'm going to put the link in the description um, you know they've got Facebook they've got forums on the go so yeah so just go on have a look click around see what you think um, I haven't tried this but I'm really really interested by this project and I might purchase a, a pie um, for this uh, at the moment I'm using my one for GPIO you know hardware related things um, so for me it wouldn't be a good option but if you're solely using the Pi for software you know web server Apache email server you know SMTP that kind of stuff you know it's really really interesting so anyway guys I hope you've enjoyed this video I hope it's informed you you know I hope, <laughs> I hope the quality is okay uh, the microphone that kind of thing um, but you know stay tuned I'm gonna get more Raspberry Pi videos I'm looking for more projects so if you know of anything like this send me a link you know private 
uh, putting in the comments, whatever. So um, anyway, thanks for watching, guys. <laughs>